right there. What am I doing with this? Just hold that and... Hold on, let's uh, move this baggy thing. I feel like a cat. That makes sense because that's a Felix. Yeah. That's a literally a Felix the Cat mm -hmm. air freshener, which you can't get much more old school gangster, yeah. low rider, classic I Chevy what it Impala. Like. We still have this thing sealed up. Doesn't matter. It smells like Felix the Cat. Felix the Cat is awesome. Ah, love it. What do, you, what do we get done? It, this is crazy. I don't even know. We got twin antennas mm -hmm. on the 60 Impala. Mm -hmm. This is literally Felix Figueroa. That's what I'm talking about. Figueroa at Jefferson Felix 3330. You already and know. There's a Chevy uh, bow tie on there too. We love it. We do. You're so adorable. Little kitty cat. <laughs> What are we doing tonight, Matt? Okay, Miss Allison, Miss Hot Rod Alley. It doesn't feel very hot tonight. It's very cold. No, it's chilly, but Ugh. we're dedicated to the game. Yes. So tonight we are going to be installing the dual antennas. Which is going to look so cool. It's going to be freaking awesome. The 1960 Impala. Which we've going to be epic. Dubbed the amazing name of... Ba -da -da -da. We're still deciding. Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> it's Latin. Yeah. <laughs> we okay. have this thing where we always name our vehicles. And so um, usually a name comes to us a lot quicker, but I don't know why. It's a little harder on this one. Maybe because it's just so cool. How about Gangster Street Whip that um, we love? Maybe comment below if you have any suggestions for a really good name. Uh, for the 60 Impala. I like it. Mm -hmm. I like it. And okay. here is the really awesome rear end. Just think how cool it's going to look with the dual antennas. Hopefully we can get them nice and symmetrical. I like symmetry. It's a nice idea. <gasps> oh, there's Ray! Ray, Ray! Hey, Ray. My little shop pup. Yeah, are you up on the lift too? Yeah. Oh, you're such a good boy. Staying warm enough? Hmm? Yeah, you know. That's your spot, huh? That's your spot. Who's such a good boy? Who's such a good boy? Yes. Okay. All so. right, Matt. So you're, you've got your measure tape. We're ready to rock. And you've got your t uh, tape tape. Yes. So now, they say, from what I've seen on the forums, because this is like an aftermarket item. Um, actually, before I forget, big shout out to the homie, Cali Chevy Life, right here. Got you, brother, representing, holding it down. Please, please, please. Man, hold it down for me as well, because you know we're trying to grow. Subscribe, comment, do everything you can to help us grow. We always, we always want to try and support our friends, our homies, everybody else in the car community that's trying to grow as well, which I can't even say they're trying to grow because Kelly Chevy Life, man, my boy is doing his thing big time and you got to love a red 5.9 drop. I mean, killing the game. So, <laughs> but okay. So what we're going to do here from what we have seen in these cars from this accessory option, whatever this may be called, these are, I don't know. There's kind of like a... Uh, I don't know what you call it, like a not a disagreement, but there's there's a bunch of people saying there's different bunch of different options. But I think what makes sense when you look at the photo a debate, a debate, a I dispute, like that. dispute. Okay, so thirty six and a half. They say from the tail fin. Now on our tail fins, we do not have the trim on there. So I mean, you could say from the trim on the tail fin. I don't know. I'm gonna say from the tail fin on here, we're gonna go thirty six and a half. Here ish That's it. 36 and a half. Oh. And so they say, I've looked at both, inch and a half and inch and three quarters. I feel an inch and a half is too close. Yeah. So we're going to go. Way too close. It's it's way too close, right? It's way too close. Yeah. That's for the hole. I would have thought it would have been back here. No, it's not that far up. It, it is it is in this region. It is in this region. Hmm. got to remember, this is a huge, huge trunk segment. So, Indeed. Beware of dog. Where's that guard dog? Hey, guard dog. Guard dog. Hey, guard dog guy. Beware of him. Beware of him. Right. He's a good boy. That's his sign. 
Oh yeah, family night in the in the shop tonight, huh? Family night in the shop. I love it. Hey. hey. Well, that's what we do here, friends. We wing it. But hey, if it looks good, <laughs> let's just make it happen. Okay. Amazing gasket. So retro sounds gasket. Super pliable. I Hold like it that. up to this to the camera because the gaskets. I mean, it's very flexible. Very nice. It looks like a giant barrette. There we go. <laughs> That's what most Impala oh. guys and Impala women <laughs> they would compare to a barrette. Uh, let's see. Got some great looking pieces right there. Lots of shinies. <sighs> Lots of shinies. Yeah, this has something to do with this. This is amazing because there's zero instructions. Oh, well, you yeah, know. It's always awesome. Hey, Good friends, way to figure learn. it out. They are assuming you are intelligent enough to figure it out. I guess so. Thanks for having so much faith in us, Retro Sound. <laughs> okay. This has got to be the size of the hole, so we can check this out. That means this hole is got to be at least up to there. You know that gold thing to figure out the size? For some reason it makes me think of like the Aztecan ruins. It pretty much is the exact same thing. Except it's a circle instead of a square. Okay, so these two pieces of tape, I'm throwing those right over at the 36 and a half mark. Okay. And now what I would like to do is I'm going to come an inch and three quarters in. All right, so if I'm going an inch and three quarters in, right in the center. Do you need a pen? There's a red pen here. Yeah, we use it. I just, I'm just kind of winging it right now. I don't want to do anything permanent yet. So you use permanent marker? Right, that always works. Okay. You want to do it? No! I mean, no. No, I don't. It looks scary. It's a big deal. It's kind of a big deal. Cubbies, they're not all the same size. What do you mean? Um, you have differing sizes in there, so how would you... Oh, no! See, that's what happens when you talk smack. I didn't... What? <laughs> Sorry, I love you. You are the how soul did I... of my how body. Did I... That's gross. We're leaving that out. Oh, you are not the soul of me for... Stop talking years. weird. So. Um, that's why you spend so much time in the garage, because you're always busy looking for you things that you haven't organized. You need to get back to work, because... Uh. That is a big hole. Oh, man. Yeah. yeah. So, the center of the big hole is two and three quarters. Two and three quarters. Yep. And that big hole is up at 37 and a quarter. All right. So 37 and a quarter. Two and three quarters. Two and three quarters. Seven eighths. Inch and seven eighths to the center. I'm remembering inch and seven eighths. Inch and seven eighths. Okay. And two and nine sixteenths. So now that those holes are drilled, we're going to be putting those on. I'm simply putting a lock washer on and I don't know if you're going to be able to see nope, anything. Nope, probably not. Okay, I'm just putting a little nut on there just to make sure it's a little bit good. Can you hold that for a sec? Sure. Oh, there's a little movement. Okay. That's through. Next, the Next. wand. It's going to go. The telescoping. Make sure it's on there good. Okay, that's cool. You happier with that? I'm very happy with that. Okay, okay. good. Okay, so that side. So this does need to be tightened up with a wrench on the back side. Okay. Which we'll do that in a minute. Okay. This will probably be the side that will run the antenna. Okay. Um, the antenna wire. Okay. 
Ja. But it smells good now. <laughs> you want to hand me some of those uh, parts over there? Um, sure. Let's see what I can find. I know we need this. And this. And this. Probably those tiny, tiny pieces. So, let's see if that works. just need to... Uh, Memento. Oh yeah, I think that should work just fine. Let's test it. If that don't work, I don't know who you are. You know what? If you can hold that. Yeah, push it down. Like, yep, just hold that like that. Hello. Yeah, I'm not going through oh. Um I'm not sure what what's going on here. And the washer's now, um, super, the super gasket close. is not... Super close, though. So, what's the deal? Why are we not fitting? Almost there. There's like a... a whoopee. I've you seen know that. what I'm talking about? I do see that. Covered in metal shavings. I think that might have worked, though. <laughs> That might have worked. Uh, well, we've got some metal shavings in here now. It's not going to look as clean. Oh, look at that. That's like it was meant to be, huh? All right. Okay, so just stay right there. And uh, you need this? Yeah. So, so what is this part for? What you're going to do is you're going to put that inside. The, no, 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 in the end of here. See how it fits in there? Oh, it squares okay. up. Why don't got you show it. us how that squares in there? Oh, the satisfying click. Yep. Mm -hmm. If it's in there just like that. Okay. okay. Nice and flush. Now you're gonna. Oh. Yep. <laughs> you're not gonna drop it, but that's, that's okay. That's the second time. It's so Third right. time's a charm, right? Yep. Thank goodness okay. the floor's not dirty. So. Okay. Put that on there. Okay. And remember, you're gonna thread that. On. So hold the black plastic piece, and you're gonna. Yeah, you're gonna. Don't thre I thread this? No, thread the black plastic piece onto the base. Okay. As much as you can. Threading. So, I'm going to tighten this up a little bit just by finger. And we're going to do something really cool here in just a minute. What are we going to do? It's a surprise. <gasps> Ooh. Do you want me? You just come this way. Okay. Okay, so I think we have some kind of a surprise. We have everything done except <gasps> Oh, we, that's right. We have everything done. So, I remember so, what the surprise is yeah, now. We'll look that up later. It has a little something to do with that. Big shout out to the homie Cali Chevy Life. What's up, baby? We got those. Oh no, I'm I'm dropping everything. I'm dropping the had too much of that beautiful well of whiskey this evening. Look at that. We got the Felix. We got the the Chevrolet Impala. It'd be easier to see outside of the packaging. I know, but, but we're gonna leave those in there because we're not installing. All right, in. all right, okay, and so what do we have for to, the double end? We're about to christen. About to christen. Let's see. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on, baby. There we go. There we go. Whew. Okay. All Look right. At that. With the 76 the ball. Which one should I have? It? Should I have it facing the back, the side? What do you think? Um, you know what? Well, They're probably right, going to float around. So For okay. right now, I think it should be facing me. Yeah, I know. The they they kind of spin freely. So it's yeah, all good. that looks so cool. Um, I think the antenna's like money on there. Yeah, I mean, it's hard to beat that. Oh, the light on this side makes it really hard to appreciate both sides. Yeah. But it looks so cool. Good, good. Yeah. Boy, they look cool, honey. They look cool. I'm digging it. Good. I'm digging it. Mission accomplished. Mission accomplished. We got twin antennas on the 60 Impala. Nope. I'm flipping it back to you. Oh. So. We well, have twin antennas on twin the Twin antennas. 60 what? What? All right. That's like really cool. Oh, look at that. With the, man, money. All right. So where are we at, babe? Uh, This is driver's studio. 
Um, we're in our garage where Matt spends a lot of time. Honestly, I don't come out here as often, but um, I'm the one who's doing the editing of the videos. We appreciate y'all. We love you. We do. We we so appreciate. Thank you. No, we love you. We oh, love you. Me? Oh. Yes. Oh, thanks. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you for giving comments and feedback. Um, we're trying to listen and make the videos better. What should everybody do for the YouTube channel? Oh, um, you should subscribe. You should share. You should comment. You should like. Um, cause we're trying to grow when we get to a thousand subscribers, we are going to give cash away. No scam, right? This is not no a scam. scam. We not a scam. We're going to give you our hard earned money and we would like to just have that be a thank you to one of our random subscribers. So the way that you can get to be one of the potential winners is to subscribe and to get more of your friends and, uh, cohorts to subscribe so that there's more people so that we get to that thousand mark and then we will hand out some cash to somebody. Love it. Love so, it. Yeah. Um, thank you for uh, hanging out with Matt and I. Obviously, I do not know what I'm doing as I've dropped <laughs> multiple things and not been much help for Matt. But hey, we got it. Thanks for hanging out with us tonight. And we're going to go inside where it's warm. Um, come back and join us next time. And uh, if you haven't gotten to check out some of our past videos, please have fun um, browsing through those. Mm -hmm.